Ubiquity leaked something massive, and I mean that quite literally. It seems to be a 4, 8, and 16 bay Unify NAS in the works, and hopefully this is something we're going to see soon. Ubiquity just dropped Drive 3.0, and in their video, you can see quite clearly there are definitely some new models coming. So let's take a look. As it stands currently, this is all the information that we have. So on the left hand side, we can see what looks like a four bay NAS. However, I will add the caveat in that I could be mistaken and this just could be the UNVR. One in the middle and the one on the right hand side are definitely new models that are on the way. We have the 16 bay enterprise model in the middle. And if we zoom in, and if we have a closer look right here, it clearly says Enterprise NAS. Unfortunately, they don't zoom into the other models, so I can't see what they are. And the one on the right hand side looks to be an 8 bay NAS. So we can see there's no LCM display included on any of them, and they have included an extra drive bay in there. But in this video, they don't show anything else but what's on the front of them. So they don't show any connectivity or any drives or any specifications that they're going to be. However, I would definitely imagine that there would be the existing 10 gigabit connection and possibly what would be a good addition is if they included a 25 gig link too. They're definitely going into the market to try and appeal to a broader range. So you have the slimline four bay, which could be someone with a small business or even a consumer prosumer. We have the eight bay, which again could be the small to medium businesses or even a large business that's looking for something like this. And then we have the enterprise model. What will be interesting to see if there is anything that will come in terms of stackable units to see if we can stack multiple of these together, but that's yet to be seen. There are a couple of things that I would like to see coming to this NAS and hopefully they do do this. One would be NVMe support. I think we're all screaming out for that. We definitely want that for the faster drive speed. And the other one would be SSD caching. I know a lot of you will be telling me right now what about third party support. I think so far Ubiquiti have shown what they're going to be doing and the path that they're going down and I think it's very unlikely that they're going to bring third party app support. That being said I have said stuff in the past and the opposite has happened so this is just purely speculative. The final thing I'm going to add and one thing I want to see if they'll bring to the enterprise NAS is the bezel support. So we know we have this for the EMVR and I've got this on the screen. They have a bezel accessory support accessory port just up here and if we go to the unified drive video you can definitely see that accessory port right there so it'll be very interesting to see if they do bring the bezel to it and what the bezel will actually do and i think in terms of the backup of the enterprise nas you're sort of going to see a similar sort of setup here but let me know what features you would want to appear in these units and also which one you're going to add into your setup or your deployments as always, be sure to hit the subscribe button. As you know, as soon as we get these products, we will be bringing you reviews. For now, this is Inside Wire, and I'll see you in the next one.